brought cinnamon buns. Do you want a cinnamon bun? Ooh, is it? Okay, I want a cinnamon bun. Good morning guys, welcome to another weekly vlog. Welcome to another vlog. It's a weekly vlog. Um, today is Easter, I figured I'd start off a vlog today. I'm pretty sure the boys are getting sick. Baby Nolan is three and a half weeks old and he has a tiny little cough. So I'm very nervous as to how the next few days is gonna go. Um, I hope it doesn't get worse. He, before I had him, I had pink eye, right? And um, I'm worried that he's got that, but the boys seem to have new cold symptoms, so maybe he just has like a cold. I don't know. Nick had to work today, so Easter this morning we did like a hunt, and then he left for work. So I'll include that footage here. <gasps> Life is a winding road. Oh, no telling where oh, it goes. Driving through days and nights. Won't stop for traffic lights. <laughs> Should we see what's in them? Searching for my highs. You can say I lost my mind. I will keep on holding my head high. Even if the sky is falling down. excitement um, and yeah so I'm just sitting here trying to put on makeup which I don't normally do I've been home with the boys for a couple days by myself and I haven't put makeup on but I feel so much better when I do so I'm sitting here earlier with a mirror in my bag and the boys were like trying to play with my makeup so I'm sure maybe if it becomes a regular thing that I sit out here and try and put a little bit of makeup on, they'll care less. Mommy, I play again! Ashton, Play-Doh's not for eating. So I did my face makeup. And I'm just gonna put on mascara.
there. Even if that's all I put on today, it's better than the past two days. Um, so yeah, I figured I would just do like a week vlog um, and kind of just share little bits. Easter Bunny bought this from the baby news store. Oh, look around. Hello, Yoko. Come in. Come in. Hayden, mm -hmm. will you come get in a picture of all of us? and smoothies. It's been a while since I've done smoothies and I want to get back to doing them regular but with everybody about to get sick. Some spinach, some pineapple and mango. Beans. 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 Ashton got this book for in his Easter basket from the Easter Bunny. And I just had to capture this moment because I'm feeding Nolan here. And I, Ashton's in the chair too. Ash, come back. Let's read. Feel this. Okay, get your stew there. Good, come back. Come up. Come on up. What is the book called? Um, probably a terrible angle with the window behind me. It's the next day, so I'm gonna just carry on the vlog. What ended up happening yesterday? Um, after Ashton's nap, my dad and stepmom came over uh, for a quick visit, and then I went over to my mom's house, and Hayden and Ashton, they slept at grandma's house. Um, she ordered Boston pizza, like restaurant food for them. They were so happy to stay. Um, she has like a room set up for them over there because she used to watch them like once a day, once a week, one day a week. Um, but yeah, she has a room set up over there for like them to stay the night and stuff and tons of toys. So they love going over there. This one's cough is getting a little bit worse i really like having the owlet on him at night to be able to monitor that he is okay and it would like alert us um he's doing like a little sleepy smile but yeah anyway so today is monday um i have to go pick up the boys right now Nolan and I slept in really late and then when I woke up um, we had the robot vacuum we have like a shark one running this morning but it didn't do a great job so I had to like re-vacuum the whole house and then I mopped the floors <laughs> so everything right now is like up on surfaces like his play mat the boys' chairs all of our dining room <laughs> tables so it's funny because like things look a lot cleaner than they are because it's just the floor but yeah 
Anyways, I told my mom I would be there to pick them up around 1 and that is right away. So it's like, I still need to travel there. But um, if you don't know, Sephora has really easy returns lately. Um, I bought an eyeshadow that I thought was like a luster, like a little sheen, but it was like full on sparkles. And like I tried to just put them like a little bit on my lid and like everything, there's a lot of fallout and everything. So anyways, I am returning it and Sephora has super easy returns. Now. Like very similar to Amazon, um, where you just like print out a shipping label and put it in the mail. So I love that. I'm just finishing my iced coffee, having a couple of eggies. Easter season is almost over and I won't be able to get them anymore. But seriously, one of those big bags I can finish in like two or three days. It's sad and crazy and it's probably good that they're going away. Okay, so I gotta go get the boys and I'll pick this up later. So we came home and we didn't have the TV on. We were just having a good time. The boys were into their Easter stuff. But Ashton, um, I don't think I've told the vlog yet, but we potty trained Ashton like a month and a half ago. And I don't want to talk like about his potty training too much, but we still struggle with number two. Um, he just, he's like night training himself. So he's not going at night. Like with Hayden, he would go at night and we would change him at like 10 or 11 PM. Ashton's not doing that. He's basically night training himself and he doesn't want to poop in his diaper. He doesn't want to poop on the potty. So it becomes a big panic. Um, nothing was distracting him very well. So now we're just watching super simple songs. Ashton is really into like singing nursery rhymes and stuff. So it's a great alternative for him. And Hayden's almost five and he still likes watching this every once in a while. Just doing grilled cheese for dinner, which I just made and almost burned but didn't quite tomato soup this is the one that i use with nick working so much overtime i don't know why i just don't like cooking our usual dinners when he is not here eating them with us um but yeah that's what we're doing for dinner one thing that i need to get done before bedtime is changing hayden sheets so these mickey ones these are from amazon they're pretty good but they're very like slippery uh, change them out for these ones the only sheets that he has are Mickey sheets I should probably get some more but um, I don't know I just haven't and they're expensive and I don't know um, So this is the boys' shared room. This is Hayden's big boy bed. We got it off of Marketplace for $50. And I love it. I got these prints from Etsy. They are drawings of the designs of Transformers. That one is Sideswipe. One of the Dinobots and Optimus Prime. These shelves are centered on the wall. Um, so Ashton's crib is here right now, but soon there'll be a toddler bed there. And then the dresser will be centered in the wall. Um, maybe some nightstands there. And then we just put the chair here for now. It's nice to have it in here. I wish that we had space for a chair because it's nice to read books on. Um, and then Nick did this closet organizer, so it's completely custom. Like, he built it. Lots of books in there. And... We need this extra space for their clothes because they have too much. It doesn't fit in all the drawers. And then this is their book storage. Uh, Nick hung these. And then this is supposed to be clear on top. but And then just have those books back there. And in here is all of their stuffies. 
that is an air purifier and that one just says it's cool to be kind i have a few more things to hang around the walls but we just haven't gotten to it yet and we're waiting for ashton's toddler bed which nolan is just three weeks right now so he probably won't be moving into the crib for another three months but yeah i love their room Hey guys, it is the next day. Um, it is like 11 o'clock. <coughs> Nolan seems to be feeling better today. Um, he's still got a little bit of a cough and a little bit of congestion. Um, so we're doing the nose Frida a lot at night and yeah. Um, I can't believe he's actually going to be one month old in three days, which is just crazy to me because it feels like he was literally just born. I just put him in his car seat. We are going to return some library books and then um, just go into the dollar store to get a birthday card. But I was just putting him in here and I was like, oh my gosh, you look so big in your car seat now. And his little outfit is from my good friend Brittany and I like to call it his pizza fit. It's so cute. It's from Superstore here in Canada, but, and he looks so cute in it. That's his little cough. It's so sad to see like a newborn have a cough and congestion and all that. But honestly, he seems like unbothered by it, um, which I wasn't expecting. Like I fully expected him to like cough and then like be scared and cry. Um, but every time he coughs, he seems unbothered. Um, uh, we're just watching for any signs of a fever, um, uh, or any signs of, like, him having trouble breathing, but so far he's been fine. Uh, I just fed him, and I'm popping him into his car seat, and he will definitely sleep the entire time that we're out. Um, he likes his car seat so far we actually decided to get a lot roomier of a car seat this time so that could have something to do with it we got the peg prugo agio i will link it i will link it down below because honestly we spent a little bit more on a car seat for this baby for our third baby um but it's because ashton hated his car seat he was also born during covid and we didn't grow out that much so that could have something to do with it um but nolan seems to like his car seat my outfit is an old airy tee um leggings and this is the free people what is this jacket called i don't know it's the fleece one honestly i think it looks like so bulky on me i don't know I like it on other people more than I like it on myself. Nike blazers. And I got this package from Zara. Uh, it's mostly clothes for Hayden. Uh, maybe I'll do a quick haul of that when we come back. We're back. I need to get a birthday card. Can't go into the dollar store without leaving with a bunch of stuff. I think like my favorite place to go get little like activities or small games for the boys um Hayden's birthday is in a week and a half my oldest will be five it's crazy so I got some wrapping paper I like this one just plain rainbow and then this one is kind of like superhero ish themed but like not a specific superhero and it's just like bright and colorful and then i just grabbed some bows it's a two pack um hayden's favorite color is red so i grabbed that and i saw this at the dollar store um it was five dollars but it's a good deal for a play-doh set it just makes a little ice cream it's just a small set i thought it was pretty cute and only five dollars i grabbed this tiny little play-doh thing that has two different colors in it and then you can make uh, a little fry box with it so I thought that was kind of cute 
And then I also got the boys these baseball glove catcher mitts and they each come with a ball. The palm of the glove is Velcro so it's like easy for them to catch. I got them each one so they're not gonna fight over it and so they, they can play together. And then the last thing I got was just two baskets, just always trying to get more organized. So I grabbed those. I don't know if I'll be able to show all the Zara stuff with this little one sleeping in my arms. I have to go pick up the older boys right away. Um, so I wanna get this guy fed and then I'll have to get him into the car and get going. Uh, so I'll try and show the Zara stuff later. But yeah, let me know. Do you guys also frequent your dollar store and grab a bunch of items? <laughs> hey guys, it is uh, the next morning. It's Friday. Um, I've been running around all morning trying to like clutter, declutter the house because we we're supposed to have a cleaner coming tomorrow or coming today. Um, but they called like five minutes before they were supposed to come. Like the company that we use said that they, the cleaner that was supposed to come like wasn't available and they couldn't get somebody else. So anyways, it's canceled. So the house is like ready for a clean. <laughs> if you hire a cleaner you kind of like wait for things like push things a few times a few days past when they need it so like the house needs a really good vacuum and sweep and with the dogs coming in and out and it being spring now the how the floors need a good mopping so i'm gonna do that um but yeah having a house cleaner we get it about like once a month it was something that my mom got us as a gift. She like paid for half of an entire year of house cleanings, which is just like such an amazing and thoughtful and good gift. Like something that is obviously gonna be used. It was like, cause you know, we're both full-time working parents and it was just an amazing gift. So now I'm on maternity leave, obviously with Nolan and we'll still get them once a month. It's amazing to have the bathrooms deep cleaned and everything. But yeah, that's kind of what I'm doing today. So the floors are just kind of bare. I have all of the chairs up so that I can do a good cleaning on the floor. And then once I get myself a little bit more together for the day, um, I just got out of the shower and Nolan is over there in the swing. I had him just in the bathroom with me in the little bouncer um but yeah i will show you guys that zara haul i love the frida baby baby ones and one of the reasons why i love them is because they're not loud like you know i don't know i feel like the other type of nail clippers could be a little bit scary for kids these ones i've never cut their skin and they've never been scared of it you can get really close too because like you push the bottom part into the nail and then the style of them is just, it's more like a scissor than a nail clipper. There's been a couple times where I swear he's smiling and it's so young to be smiling. He's four weeks old. You are one month old tomorrow. Are you smiling already? Oh, excuse you. Excuse you. <laughs> Do you want more milk? Okay, it's like coming to the end of his wake window, so um, I'm gonna feed him and probably lay him down.
If you haven't used this stuff, it's so good. It smells so good. It smells like almond, like an almond extract. And you just like squirt it on the floors as you're mopping. thing I wanted to do before I go and pick the big boys up is I have these bins to go in the top of their closet and I just made these little labels to go on the bins so this one says Hayden's next size up and uh, I made one for Ashton too and it's just their clothing that they don't fit into yet and so I can stick it at the top of their closet and I don't have to pull down the bin to know what's in there just with the boys sharing a room, we just have limited space for storage, so I'm just trying to use it to the best of my ability. Um, yeah, so this bin I used to already have in Hayden's closet, and then Ashton's I used to have his extra clothes in a drawer that wasn't being used, but now we have no unused drawers, so. Making echoes as we walk There's no one left but you and me It's like a made up place that only we can see We are home from daycare pickup and Hayden or and Ashton is at the age where he needs to help with everything. Did you crack it? Yeah. Good job. Um, yeah. Okay, don't crack another one just yet, okay? Because mommy wasn't even ready for this one. So hold on, okay? Just a sec. I need to put some oil in the pan. Are you helping? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Crack. Uh. Hold on. Ta-ta. No touch, because it's already cracked. No touch. See, it's already cracked. Okay, get another one. Do a little tap tap. Good. Very good. Got the more? Uh, one more. One more? Mm hmm. Tap, tap. Very good. A little tap. <laughs> Mine? Okay, now we just let it cook, okay? Yeah. Let me wash hands. Me too. I'll slide you over. We are just doing a very easy breakfast for dinner. Dinner. Um, turkey bacon, eggs, Dad. fruit, pancakes. All done? Okay. Oh, rinse. Rinse. Bubble. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's add more water. One sec. That's okay. Wash. No, no, no. We're still going to use it. Done. Very good. We'll put that on the sink. Good 
Other one? Yeah. Thank you, buddy. just oh. finished their dinner and they're having a little bit of their Easter chocolate. E <laughs> e take a bite. Does it look like a bunny? Yeah. Apple bunny. Apple Ashley, bunny. you want to eat it? Take a bite on the ear. Oh. Good? Actually, which one? Brown chocolate. White chocolate. Oh, we didn't know you like white chocolate. A box here to show what I ordered for mostly Hayden. He's the oldest. Um, Ashton has a lot of hand-me-downs or is gifted a lot of clothes from grandparents. Um, sometimes I'll buy them like matching things. So he gets new stuff, but he doesn't need obviously quite as much new stuff. So most of this stuff was ordered for Hayden. Um, Zara is my favorite place to buy like stylish boys clothes um, so I got him a spring jacket he is almost five it's his birthday like right away so I got him a five six in most things this is going to be his spring jacket um, I also have like a North Face water resistant jacket that I bought him um, so this is, is more casual and this one is more water resistant and the other one is waterproof so yeah I just thought that this was cute stylish light colored um, very pretty and then I also got him a puffer vest which I just think are so stylish I don't really think they're like necessary um, in like a necessary wardrobe staple because staple because like you don't really need a vest but I just loved it. And I think I got this one in a four or five because the other size was sold out. So um, he can wear that for a little bit. And then of course it'll get handed down to other boys. Uh, Hayden has been choosing to wear zip up hoodies over, over, the, ugh, over the head, like crew necks and hoodies. So I wanted to get him another zip up hoodie. And this was um, just one of the uh, different lines they have right now it's that big olita and actually ashton has a big olita hoodie too that he got gifted from his grandma so uh different colors but yeah so hayden will like that because it zips up in the front and then i got him this summer set so this was a t-shirt and shorts set um so I thought that that was really cute, um, like pattern on pattern. It's really busy, but I mean, they're only young ones, so dress them up in that cute stuff. What else? Oh, he's obsessed with sleeveless stuff, so I got him this sleeveless hoodie. I think this was a set, yeah. It was a set with a pair of shorts, so now we're set for like black shorts for the summer. These are a size 5, 6, and he'll be wearing a lot of his shorts from last summer too, so. Um, I got him these jeans. He has them in like a smaller size or something similar at least. Um, I just think they're really cute and like stylish right now. They're just like a low rise wide leg pant. I also got him these shorts, which looking at them right now. I got them in a 4.5, they seem really big, um, but I tend to buy his shorts quite short, so uh, we'll see how these fit him and see if he likes them. I also got him these vertical stripe shorts, just something different. Um, 
yeah, so after this order, he's definitely set on shorts. I don't need to buy any. And I got two graphic t-shirts. One is a Nirvana one, which he won't even understand what Nirvana is, but Nick and I love it. And it also says Nirvana on the back. He'll probably just like the smiley face. And then another crocodile shirt. This one guy is surfing and it's bright orange, so that'll be fun for summer. I think I was kind of thinking that like this would be like a busy but fun outfit. Also these green shorts. And then he's been really loving just wearing different kinds of socks. So I got him these checkered socks. Um, he wears like the Vans checkered shoes uh, as his indoor shoes at school so he'll like that and then I got him these three pack of white socks um, that will just look cute with all of his shorts in the summer and let's see one uh, black t-shirt for Hayden I like their plain tees like this one is $9.90 any of the graphic tees tend to go up to like $17 and stuff like that but the plain basic tees are very reasonably priced at Zara, like $10 for a tee. And I got Ashton one thing, because he is obsessed with Mickey Mouse, and I like the Disney stuff that Zara does, because it's usually like a little bit different. This was for like their 100 Years of Wonder um, stuff that they have out right now. Um, and yeah, so it just has some characters on the front, Chip and Dale, Mickey and Donald. And then the back, has Mickey, Rex, Donald, and Timon. Um, yes, yeah, so this is a size 3-4 for Ashton. Every morning he wants to pick something that is Mickey Mouse, so get him a few bigger shirts because he's gonna grow out of all of his Mickey Mouse shirts soon. But yeah, that's it. I ordered just stuff for the boys. I ordered nothing for myself. I'm kind of in that weird postpartum phase where I hate everything in my closet and I want to buy new clothes but nothing is gonna fit but yeah anyways guys I'm gonna close out this vlog here it was a couple days thanks for hanging out with me um, and I will see you guys in my next video bye